Hello everyone, this is Teacher Karen. I'm here again for another lesson. So we are now in lesson number 148. Our topic is all about ways of describing a cell. So we have three ways of describing a cell. The first one is verbal description method. It is a method of describing sets in a form of sentence. Set B is the set of distinct letters in the word kindness. The second one is rooster or listing method. It is done by listing each element inside the braces and each element are separated by commas. Example, set B is equal to open close parentheses and then the distinct letters in the word kindness which R, K, I, N, B, D, S. The third one is set builder or rule method. It is a method that lists the rules that determines whether an object is an element of the reset rather than the actual element. The notation X and then X is read, read as the set of all x such that x. Example, set B is equal to set B is equal to x such that x is distinct letters in the word kindness. Another example for the three ways of describing the set. In verbal description method, we have Set A is the set of natural numbers less than 6. Then, if we change it into rooster or listing method, we have set A equal to open close braces 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Another one, if we change it into set builder or rule method, we have set A equal to X such that x is a natural number less than 6. Another example, in verbal description method, we have set C. It is the odd numbers from 3 to 15. If we change it into rooster or listing method, we have set C equal to 3, 5, 7, 9, 11, 13, and 15. And if we change it into set builders or rule method, we have set C is equal to X such that X is the odd numbers from 3 to 15. In our module, quarter 1, module 1, week 1, page 8, we have activity number 4 there. We call it notation. We have here the sample for verbal describing method so we will write it using a rooster method and a set builder method we are here the five example of verbal describing method and then we will change it into rooster method and set builder method okay number one Set M is the set of months having 31 days. If we change it into rooster method, we have set M is equal to January, March, May, July, August, October, December. While if we change it into set builder method, we have set M is equal to open close spaces x such that x is the month having 31 days. In number 2, in verbal describing method, we have set B is the set of days of the week beginning with the letter T. So in rooster method, we have set B equal to Tuesday, Thursday. If we change it into set builder method, we have T equal to open close B x such that x is the day of a week beginning with the letter t. Number 
number three, in verbal describing method, we have set W is the set of whole numbers between 11 to 20. If we change it into rooster method, we have W is equal to open close braces 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, and 19. And then, in set builder method, we have W. Open close braces x such that x is the whole numbers between 11 to 20. Okay, we proceed to number 4. In verbal describing method, we have set E is the set of prime numbers less than 20. So in this method, we have E is equal to open close braces 2, 3, 5, 7, 11, 18, 17. Don't forget to write them comma for the separate step for the separate okay next number four in set builder we have set p is equal to x as set x is the prime number less than 20. okay the last number five set e is the set of the last 10 letters of the alphabet if we change it into rooster we have set e equal to open close braces Q, R, S, T, U, B, W, X, Y, Z and Don't forget the comma for your separator And then number 5 Set E is equal to X such that X is the set of the last 10 letters of the alphabet Next What are the ways of describing the set? First one is verbal description method. Number two, rooster or listing method. Number three, set builder or uh, rule method. What is verbal description method? In verbal description method, we have it is a method of describing sets in a form. elements are separated by comma. Number 3. What is set builder or rule method? It is a method that leads to rules that determines whether an object is an element of the set rather than the actual element. So, again, see you again next time. God bless.